Hello and welcome to today's course. Now in this lecture we will take a look at an introductory example from the field of medical diagnosis. The goal is to develop a feel for probabilities and also for the deceptive properties of human intuition. In this example you should imagine that you are a doctor who has to conduct cancer screening to diagnose patients. In one case a patient is tested positive on cancer. What you have is the following background information. So 1% of all people that are screened actually do have cancer. Secondly, 80% of all people who have cancer will test positive. And thirdly, 10% of people who do not have cancer will also test positive. Now, the patient is obviously very worried and wants to know the probability for him actually having cancer, given the positive test result. And the question to you is, what is the probability for the test being correct? Now, think about this for a minute or two, and then let's get back to the result. So, what was your guess? Studies at Harvard have shown that 95 out of 100 physicians estimated the probability for the patient actually having cancer to be between 70 and 80 percent. Maybe that was also your guess. However, if you do run the math properly, where you arrive at is only 8 percent instead. To make this point really clear, in case you are ever tested positive on cancer, your chances of not having it are above 90 percent. So, what we take away from this short example is that probabilities are often counterintuitive. Decisions based on uncertain knowledge thus should be taken very, very carefully. And in this whole course, we're going to take a look at how this can be done. Let's move forward.